Did you know you can merge and delete duplicate contacts on your iPhone? That way you can keep your phone organized. Today I'm going to show you how to do this, but before we dive in, do us a favor, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to ring the notification bell. That way you never miss out on our content. First off, why do you have duplicate contacts? Well, there are a few reasons. You could have simply saved the number twice by mistake, some backup or iCloud sync issues could have happened, or contacts might have been extracted from apps or social media. The good news is you can easily fix this. Just make sure your iPhone is running iOS 16 or later for this to work, and to quickly check if you have any available iOS updates, go to Settings, General, and tap on Software Update. If your phone is up to date, let's dive right into how to merge duplicate contacts. Open the Contacts app and check the My Card at the top. If you have any duplicate contacts, a pop-up will appear below your card telling you how many there are. To view the duplicates, tap to view duplicates, select Merge All to merge these contacts, and then tap Merge Duplicates. Now, over the years, numbers change and you might notice you have duplicates with different names. These will not show up automatically, so you can use the Link Contacts iPhone feature instead. Open the Contacts app, find and choose the contact that you want to link, tap on Add it in the top right corner of the screen, scroll down and tap on Link Contacts. Here, a list of all your contacts will appear. Choose the one that you want to merge with the original contact and then tap on the Link option at the top to merge them. If you have other contacts that you want to link, follow these steps in the same order for each additional one. Now, if you want to delete duplicate contacts, there isn't a quick and easy way like the merge feature, unfortunately. So you will need to take your time, scroll through your contacts list and do it manually. Open the contacts app, select any duplicate entry and tap on edit in the top right corner of the screen. Then scroll all the way down and tap on the lead contact. And if you use iCloud, the leading duplicates is a lot easier. Sign into iCloud on your computer, click on Contacts, select all duplicates by clicking on each of them while pressing the Command key on your keyboard and click on Delete Contacts. Something really cool about deleting duplicate contacts is that you are freeing up space on your iPhone. And another great way to free up space is by removing duplicate photos. A quick and easy way for you to do this is by using the app Clean My Phone. I've included a link down below in the description for you to download it, or you can also scan this code with your iPhone to get the app. Once you open Clean My Phone, you will see the declutter option, which analyzes and sorts your media files, selecting those you may not want to keep any longer, including duplicates, blurred photos, and screenshots. And there is also the Organize module, which shows you stuff that you might want to organize and similar photos that might not be that relevant for you. After the scan is complete on both of these modules, you will have the option to tap on each of the categories of clutter to deselect the ones that you want to keep, or you can go ahead and clean it all. Now, before we move on to our last tip, make sure to check out our video on how to clear storage on iPhone as well. The link is included in the description below. And last but not least, if you need to unmerge contacts, open the Contacts app and find a linked contact. Tap on Edit in the top right corner of the screen, scroll down to the Linked Contacts section, tap on the right icon, tap Unlink, and then tap Done. And there you have it. This is how you can merge and delete duplicate contacts on your iPhone to keep things tidy. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to ring the notification bell. That way, you stay in the loop for all things iPhone. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.